Welcome to part three of my Man of Maidan series. Thanks for checking it out. What the hell is wrong with you back there? What in the groups together? Brad, you lost your shit, like big time. You almost killed me. What? What are you talking? Come on, no, no come on. That's ridiculous. Well, what the fuck <laughs> is right. going on with this ship? Because I gotta be honest, it feels like there's some like, like evil, like literal evil going on down there. Let's just stay calm and relatively sane about this, okay? The stuff I saw, it's like there were these old soldiers, they were bodies, they were dead, but then they came alive and- That doesn't sound that crazy right about now. Alex wasn't the only Alex. What are you talking about? There were things walking around with his face on them. Alex's face, it, it was horrifying. Julia, I'd never hurt you. You know that, right? No, I know, it's just- This can't all be happening. Maybe, like, one thing could, but not all of these crazy things. It's too much of a coincidence. There's gotta be something going on here. What can we absolutely be sure about? What do we know that's real? Uh, the boat? <laughs> um, where's the gold? Did you see the gold? Anything? It might be time to accept there's no gold here. We would have seen it by now. All right, what happened on this ship? What do you think actually happened to this place? No idea. I saw 1947 on the newspaper. I don't want to be fearful. Like this that's whole gonna bring place down the morale. Of weird, dirty, stinky, weird, and I don't like it. It's like this place is stuck in a perpetual bad feeling machine. All right, I'll just be unsettled, I guess. What happened to everybody on this ship? Where did they all go? I can't shake the feeling we're in one big well, they coffin. <laughs> you know. so where did all the corpses come from? They actually look like they've been scared to death. We know more than we did before. That's something, at least. We're wasting time. Whatever we do, we have to do it now. Time to get off this ship. We're not going anywhere without the distributor cap. The Duke needs it to run. Hold on. The ship's gotta have a radio. If we can find it and use it, that's great, but do you think it still works? Exactly. Just need to find a way up there. Well, let's not split up, if anything. All right, we're Alex. Uh, I don't know. I don't like being him. You gotta get on this <laughs> damn ship. I know what it is about him. No shit. I think we're, uh, speaking clinically, totally Aft. effed. Yeah, well, at least we're together. That, you know, that counts for something. That a bullet? Now let's grab it. He got grabbed last time. He grabbed some shit, so. I know it sounds crazy, but maybe it was these guns that took down the plane from our dive. Anti-aircraft shell casing. All right, that's good to know, I guess. Ain't nothing happened, so. So far, so good. <laughs> yeah, there should only be two more parts at most. We're about two and a half hours into this game. I heard it's around five hours. So, uh, yeah. I feel like I'm halfway through. They already saw some shit in the last part. They're surprisingly Great. somewhat well composed. Use these if they weren't Swiss cheese. Let's find some good old duct tape. Maybe that'll do the trick. Yeah, where the hell's Brad? He's falling back. He's the one I'm uh, most suspicious of right now. tactful and he's a little too calm for what just happened I mean, he panicked I guess I would too if I saw the head turn but yeah <laughs> seemed a little too composed considering how he was in the last part you find a way up sadly no but I'll keep my eyes open well I guess we'll have to go inside the ship right I said we just I vote for just stay on the deck and hope for the best. Oh, damn. Oh, damn, indeed. Right, there's a the documents. Oh, oh, wait, wait. I feel like we're gonna need that mask. Are right, you put that down and stepped away too quick. 
All right. I wasn't sure the mask is fitted before assisting anyone else with theirs. You can detect gas or hear the gas alarm, blah, blah, blah. gonna step away from the body he uh, tried hiding at least he didn't suffocate to death as far as I know all right Alex what can you find oh there goes Brad I was wondering where you at dude well, I guess we're gonna boost somebody up here hey a little help over here I think this is our way up. Give me a lift. Oh, she's gonna do it just herself? Damn. Mm -hmm. I'll pull you up. Oh, nice. Yeah, pull somebody up with you. Don't go solo. She's gonna go up by herself? <laughs> just hold up. Yeah, after that hint, uh, I think it's all paranormal. I have no idea. Whatever the dude, the narrator, tried to hint me with. Something about being more scientific, less supernatural. I have no freaking idea. Let's take a look around. The girls are getting too far ahead. Brad's falling back, so let me check this side first. Oh, that's just a drop. All right. can be more suspicious Brad you know you're too far behind that's crazy this came out 2019 I don't know it's felt like it came out a while ago I'm not gonna try that door just yet Let me check on Fliss Camera angles, man. Why they got changed like that? Anything? No. All right. Let me just check his traits real quick. He's relaxed and excited. All right. I see that faint glimmer of heroic, though. Oh damn! I maxed out with Julia. That's good. That's his wife. Uh, soon-to-be wife, I guess. His fiance. I guess you'll want that maxed out. And I'm pretty, pretty uh, set on Conrad being dead. I mean, <laughs> he got shot, passed out, and that was it. Over here. Got a way through here. Brad, you go first. I'll go. Hold up. There's probably one in there, but hold up. That's, uh... I'll wait. <laughs> I'll wait for them. Wait for the, gr uh, wait for the uh, group. We need... Where the hell are you guys? Alright, I'm gonna look at this desk real quick. Looks like a log book. Let's pick that up. You always gotta look at it before you open it, I guess. So... Huh. Last log shows him caught in a storm. All right. I like that he actually uh, summarizes it and says it out loud. You should do that for every note. This way, I ain't gotta read it. Where the hell they go? All right, there's Brad. There's another door. Oh, here, premonition. Ooh, all right, I think I'm cool with that. Loose cannon. Let's see if we can get him to do that. If it means uh, keeping our asses safe. Find the radio yet? 
Oh, nice. No, but there's got to be a radio on this ship. There, there has to be. Well, there's a radio, but uh, that dude <laughs> who died, he saw the, uh, I guess, the most Something's monstrous wrong here. ghost. If you were headed to San Francisco, you'd be crazy to take this route. It's almost like they didn't want anyone to know they were coming. Hmm. Like hide and seek out in the ocean? Planned route versus actual route. I got a secret though. Yeah, I'm more. I mean, with other people here, I'm uh, more comfortable picking up shit. Cause I, I skipped a lot when I was rolling solo. Let's fuck that. Uh, here we go. Was blown off course. Cloud cover was bad. They couldn't establish a position. Damn, someone went overboard. That sucks. Too many bad ways to die out in the ocean. I'll stay on land. Thank you. We're not built for that shit. Right, she's looking at the map. Let me look further in. Hopefully this door don't close. Oh, yeah. That's the dude right there. All right. Well, here goes the radio. Take a look. It's on. No freaking way. This thing actually still works? Well, radio science hasn't changed much in 70 years, as long as there's power. I'll give it a whirl. All right. Ah, it's working. Let's keep turning that knob. It's a number station. Military go too far. Let's ask them for help. Hey, hey, is anyone out there hearing this? Hello? Over. Holy shit, we got him. Uh. Here, instructive. If you can hear us, we're on a ship, an old freighter. Our coordinates are approximately uh, 12 degrees, 30 minutes south, 151 degrees, 20 minutes west. Please get here now, we need help. Oh man, that's not good. Alright, anxious. We're on a freighter, abandoned, huge and old. Hello? Hello? Is anyone out there? Please come in. I knew it, it was bullshit. Oh, that's not good. Hey, come here, look. What? Bro, we're not going down there. Unless something... This uh, has got to lead somewhere. Maybe we can find a way to get the power back. We need that to get that radio. Fuck that radio, working. man. That's I think <laughs> someone should wait here in case a message comes through. I'll go. Obviously. I can do this. I should be the one to go. Hey, little bro. What's up? I'm thinking you might deserve a promotion. How's medium bro sound? <laughs> what, are you, what are you talking about? You stepped up to the plate. Put yourself right in the line of fire. You're kind of mixing metaphors there. Not if the pitcher's a machine gun. <laughs> I'm impressed. Seriously. I don't know, man. He looks way too nervous. So what do you think? He looks pale. I'm sure you're up for it, but... Okay. <laughs> if you're sure you're up for it, I believe you got it, bro. I'm coming too. Hey, what? Whoa. Julia, no. Uh, you're not always gonna be there to protect big guy. I can handle this. Trust me. Whoa, whoa. If Julia says she can handle it, she can handle it. Case closed. Okay, Julia. Uh, <laughs> what was that look? It was a bad idea, guys. Bad idea. I said... the lower deck 5 a.m. June 21st her uh, wound looks like it's bleeding any broken bones everything still work everyone okay 
We're okay. We're okay. What are we gonna do? We're gonna have to find the generator. If we can get it started, we can power up the radio. Okay. We'll wait here by the radio. Here. All right. <laughs> That's got a flashlight, but I guess the lighter will do the trick too. Maybe we should uh check if it works. Hey. Hey what? Oh. Old school uh, lantern, I guess. After you. Oh boy. All right. All right. Uh, we're Brad. Okay. Couldn't tell. So maybe he is the sane one for using him. Are right, we gonna head into sick bay? That doesn't sound good. We go in this door here. This little document. There's also something over there. I'll take a look after. Yeah, I feel like I'm blazing through this, so... Whoops. Ten, days, ten days approved. Wow. Must have really blown his oh, Charlie. kind of time. After he wanted his 50 cents back. Uh... Oh, okay. I didn't see that. Blah, blah, blah. That don't sound good. Let's put that back. Julia, I uh, kind of wish you were in here, too. All right, that's a little uh, too much to read. All right, Joseph Roberts. Huh. Roberts, excuse me. I guess there was a guy named Joe in sickbay. Oh, that's the dude that uh, we were using. Scared to death. At the end of that prologue. Alright, we're gonna keep going. What does that say? First aid? I wish I could actually, you know, enjoy this. What the hell are you the talking hell is that? about? <laughs> Glitch. Uh, in any other circumstance, you know, this place would be the coolest place to explore. Like, like ever. Like that. They know. Not at all. Says the girl who couldn't wait to dive a wreck. Shut up. It's got a point. We're going in first aid. Oh boy. Oh, this is where he was. Alright. Oh, Jesus. This dude, he was in the locker. Alright, I'm gonna stop looking at too much shit, because... It's a little risky. Okay, then. Goddamn. <laughs> I have to put all this shit there. Let's not read that. Is that picture still here? Oh, it is! that I'm gonna look at looks like young Joe or somebody's mm. uh, kid might have been the son of somebody on board Two pops come back soon yeah not young Joe somebody's kid dude you just <laughs> let's go in the same rooms woman all right I'm gonna go in there let me just check the side nothing on that side let's head on in Drop down. Give me a sec, though. Last time, he freaked himself out when he did that. Here, come check this out. Look, down there. What are we looking at? Looks like the engine room. Good place to find the generator, right? All right, gentlemen, first. <laughs> the ladder's broken off here. I think so I can just uh, wait. Uh, of course. Are you okay? Yeah. Uh, <clears throat> all good. She's gonna hurt her leg, fool. Uh. Oh no, she's good. <laughs> all right. Well. Oh God. What's up? That it, 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 it was. It was. Wait, wait. Did you see it? Um. Hello. Okay. Okay. Um. Okay, so, I, so I'm seeing things. She didn't see it, but... You're not. Yeah, I think we're all going crazy. I think it might be from that fog. Why would the fog make us go crazy? That fog? It's gas. with our heads. Maybe that's what happened here in the first place. Why there's nobody left on the ship? This couldn't have anything to do with the plane wreck we dived. It's pretty smart. Maybe there was a connection. Maybe they made contact. 
It's a theory, I guess. Oh God. All right, let's What's get the theory going. I can ride with. I like the way you think, Brad. All right, that's using, using your brain there, man. Some of that logic. And Linden Engine Works. 1734, goddamn. Or number. Never mind. <laughs> number 1734. Well, yeah, I think that gas is fucking over their head, but at the right same now. time. Dry clothes? Yeah. I think that was one of the, the one of the pirate dudes. I don't think that was a hallucination. Although she didn't see it, so maybe. Let's just keep walking. I don't want to go off trail too far, although it's hard to say if I'm actually on trail. Hey, hey! I found it! Oh, thank God! And it's working! Yep, this is it, all right. Just throw That's the switch so... and let's get back upstairs. Let's do it! Okay, let's get back upstairs. How? There's got to be another way up. Here we go. We lost power, but we have it back. Can you hear me? Over. Please state your situation. Over. We need help now. There are things on the ship that are trying to hurt us. Over. Recovery mission is on route to your location. Over. Oh, come on, work, damn it. So that helicopter in the premonition is probably gonna get fucked, you know? Why right, that thing's rolling? It's kind of weird that they showed it. So I feel like it's gonna bust. There, there is that fucking yellow fog everywhere. Oh, look at this! The rebreather. The fisherman must have brought it over from the Duke of Milan. You think it still works? Looks like it's got a little juice left. Maybe a couple of minutes. Should we bring it with us? I mean, it's heavy. It's just gonna slow us down. Let's be compliant. Yeah, fuck it. Dead weight. Shit. No. Oh man, he's still alive. No. Oh man. Écoute. Écoute Damn. That dead face. Oh shit. Alright, there is that premonition of Brad getting stabbed, so. Yeah, but. <laughs> He's freaking out now. What did I just do? Oh. Seen there's a, there's a lot of yellow gas in there. Ain't gonna lie. Ooh, what's the next I've seen? My last day, boy. You vien chercher. Les esprits morts vien me chercher. Je vous attends, bande d'enculés. I'm guessing that's the part where he's supposed to get stabbed. I hope so, because that means I got through it. All right, dude's dead. Did he grab that thing? What the hell was this? Wait. Yeah, look at that. I think we should try to avoid that. Yeah. That's for damn sure. Where was that? I don't want to look at the body. I want to grab. I guess he grabbed it. So. Look at this first. Let's get the fuck out. 
you gonna run, son? He might have had something in his hand, but... Ooh. Come back with a sledgehammer? You little foot. What's the problem with sharing all that gold, eh? There must be plenty of that to go around, more than enough. And we're all in this together, right? Trying to cut me out of the deal? Again? Okay. You can't can do this. Gold. And I'm to be left here to die. But I am the captain. I am in control. And I am the one that says who goes and who stays. So he did have it. He's breathing down our necks. Please tell me you have an escape plan. We can't risk moving. We can't risk moving yet. Just need to watch and wait for an opening. Ah, the smug Americans have smashed their way into a foreign land and come up short. The generators are on. The gold is mine, and now I'm the one who gets to smash me with my big fucking armor. I think I made the right call. <laughs> Still got that wrench, man. <laughs> Totally. I mean, these doors were meant to withstand all sorts of... All sorts of? Stuff. That train updated. That door ain't moving. Get away from it, though, you know? Okay. Oh, shit. Okay. None of you move. None of you go all changing on me now. Turn around. Slow. Real slow. Oh. Okay. All right. Not changing. None of that. Raise your hands up. Slow. Do it. No. Not like that. I said no changing. Oh man, he's Just seeing shit. Put the gun down. Nobody has to get hurt. You think I wanted to hurt anybody? I didn't get a choice in this, did I? It's in you too, isn't it? Isn't it now? Ah, not again! It's all gone changing on me! What? What's changing? Stay away! Stay back from the mist! What? There's no mist, man! Don't breathe it! Don't breathe the mist! Oh, shit. Why can't we breathe the mist? Yeah. Why can't we breathe the mist? What does it do? It's... life! Bringing things to life that shouldn't be alive. It's inside now. Inside with us now. Please just calm down. Stop. Stop. It's in one of us, isn't it? Put the gun down now. Why would you say that? Why are you telling me what to do? Yeah, you breathed in the mist. It's happening. I can feel it. Um, be worried. Okay, all, all right, look, I, there was, you know, something back there. Uh, maybe a mist or a fog, maybe? I knew it. I told you. Did you breathe it in? No. No, we held, look, we held our no, breath. No, look, we held our breath. We did not breathe any of that stuff. 
<laughs> oh, really? I know you're all fancy divers, but you expect me to buy that? We've been down here for hours. You've been holding your breath this whole time. You're holding your breath right now. Oh, good. It's in me. I got the mist in me, don't I? Oh, shit. It's in me, isn't it? Uh, uh, I can feel it swirling around in there. It's changing me. On the inside. Uh, let's distract. No, no, I, 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 I can't see it. You're all right, man. There's no mist. Stop. Stop lying. You can all see it in me, can't you? You're all just lying. The mist is inside. Keep me alive. Oh, flashlight didn't move. <laughs> hey, man, come on, just put the. All right, we're safe. Oh, fucking shit. Hey, man, better him than us. We didn't know him personally, so get that pistol. Oh, shit. That premonition, man. Oh, you said you're just gonna leave that shit? Well, I guess after what happened. Looks like we're switching to the other two. They're not uh, aware of the mist yet, though, so. All right, what are we gonna do? We by the radio. Why? I'm gonna check the next level. There might be some more gear down there we can use. Uh. No, nah, let's I'm stick not going together. Far. Just wait by the radio. I'm not going far. You're going to go down in the hole? They couldn't get up. Oh, man. This man's an idiot. Of course. No. I saw the, the the big guy. He had the distributor cap. Can we go after him? Oh, look behind just the dude with the hat. <laughs> He's waiting. He went from a mansion to this fucking boat. Thing, how are we even supposed to stop this fool? He's got a sledgehammer. This must have been what we just heard. <laughs> oh no, what's that? Doesn't matter. We need that distributor cap. Here! He had to have come this way. to the left first oh man look I'm gonna fuck this up if we do this oh, oh great now you're by yourself it's perfect boy there's something here oh I think that's dude Oh, nice. Ooh, from a 
cat's perspective right now? jump Alex I'll have to find another way around yeah thanks for dragging her down there man all right well she's gonna be by herself all thanks to Alex gotta say he's my least favorite right now That shit behind you, brother. We got a note. All right. Blah, blah, blah. Spook. All right, nothing. There goes dude. Oof. Oh, Jesus. That was quick. Unless he's just oh. seeing shit. Oh. Just that warm meat. Look at that. Sometimes you just get lucky. Get that sledgehammer first, fool. Tripping. Why would you pick it up? Just brush it off. Ooh. 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 Sam. Yo, get out of there, fool. Seeing shit. There you are. Put the knife down now. Put it down. What the fuck? You rat fucker! Keep on coming, why don't you? Killed somebody. Oh. Oh. I knew it. And she had the cap. It's not her. It's not her. It's not her. No, it's not. No, it's oh no, man, she called you by your name, fool. He's a murderer. <laughs> Killed her.
What the fuck? He's just chilling. Is that it? Okay. Guess it's time to see if it's working. Yes! I wonder if he told them what happened. I just want to know what happened to my brother. He was trying to help us to, to, to get help, but he doesn't know anything about boats or sailing. I just hope he's alive, that he's okay. God, we should have never split up. That dude is dead. Just like Fliss. Oh, well, bearing update, I guess we're not done yet. Oh man, is that him getting eaten? Uh, Connor? Oh yeah, <laughs> it's, uh, it's him. Yeesh. It's one dead ass dude. Yeah, that was fucked. Okay, that was the last part. All right, <laughs> that's that's it. That's the end. I killed two people. All because, uh, yeah, I fucked up with Connor, and well, I had a feeling that might not have been dude, but it was too late. I hit the R2 trigger too quick, and now she's dead. Just goes to show you, I always blame the merry couple. That's it. Game over. You're done. For now, at least. You could always try again, see if you can't do better next time around. Not a bad effort. Some lived, some died. All your fault. It's all about decisions, isn't it? Decisions made in a hurry, in a panic, made with the heart instead of the head, or vice versa. Sometimes those decisions take a long time to have repercussions. But there are repercussions. There are always repercussions. Till we meet again. Maybe in Little Hope, maybe somewhere else. But be certain, we will meet again. It's inevitable. All right, that was nice and short. Short and sweet, I guess. I got two people killed. Uh, but three lived, I guess. My least favorite guy lived, of course. Uh, Alex ended up killing Fliss. I had a feeling, I mean, Dude was attacking him when he had the knife, but I was just reacting, so, so he's, it was either going to be, because I was for sure going to stab, I was, I was either going to stab his own stomach, or the dude, and <laughs> I think what it did it was, uh, she said, uh, come get me rat bastard or some shit, so, she kind of asked for it, and, 
together. She's Everybody's dead. She's dead. She's dead. But I didn't want to die. Because I felt like she got dragged into this because of them. Sure enough, she died. So, uh, yeah. The next one, Little Hope. We'll play that when that comes out. It's as short as this. I'm going to do one sitting for that. Do one long video. And, yeah, do it in one fell swoop. So, yeah. Thanks for watching this. It was nice and short. Three parts. And until the next series I do, a little hope. Let's carry over to another day. Oh, that someone would pray once you come and call me another day. The children pray, the preacher preached. Time and mercy is out of your reach. Lo and behold, the pale horse and the rider who decides the fate of one who made a failed choice. Put a tail off behind it and trails off in the fire that spark those who don't know they're stuck on a stale course. Yeah, we all face death when it comes to take your breath. Usually without knowing how many days are left. Some raise their chest, others cower when it comes. Whether you're living in the towers or down in the slums. Oh, death. Oh, oh, death. Won't you spare me over till another your feet till you can't walk I'll lock your door till you can't talk I'll close your eyes till you can't see this very hour come and go with me praying heaven's coming praying it doesn't come late this is for real man it's how I push through my pain when ass is always falling and death's rain it's cold outside death look me in my eyes hold through these plans man we gotta be wise hold through together it's then they will rise I'm saying peace for all my people that can see through the lies and can that lie like Brisa running up her thighs while she's singing oh dear oh dear won't you spare me over to the night Take a moment to reflect on Think of all the things in your life that you slept on Or slip through your fingers like Teflon Cause you lost your focus steady thinking about the next dawn Saying that the next dawn you'd make things better But you didn't get a chance to make your reparations Better make some preparations But if you're not ready yet Death comes for all of us my friends So you better get Still lived, I guess. Oh shit, they're about to take it that gas. Yeah, it's gonna fuck. They called them over and then they bounced. So, out of nowhere, this thing just sent out an SOS. Guess we got a real life ghost ship here. What the hell is this? I uh, think they should just call this in. <laughs> I'll get the hell out. I'll wait on the deck. They got pretty deep uh, without seeing shit, though. Although one of the pirates are still around. Took in a lot of that gas. What the fuck? Ooh, 
Jesus. I guess that was it. I just saw someone. Oh, this is a preview. Whoever it was, they're gone. Okay, very good. Who's there? I fashioned her with my own hand. <laughs> I'm assuming they're going to release one every year. So, yeah, that should be it. If this goes back to the title screen, then I'm going to call this a video. Call it a series. All right, that's a wrap. Thanks for watching.